www.deltamath.com and get there, you'll see this window. You're going to probably create an account as a student and then enter our teacher access code, which is 361169. And you'll see my name right there. Click Algebra 2BC, enter your information. Create a password. I suggest using the same password that you do for your school login, but it's up to you. This is a password you're creating. Click Create Account. And you'll see that window. Click OK. Then you'll, li you'll log in with the information that you just set up with the password that you just entered. And when you log in, you'll see your first assignment. It's on probability. These are the problem sets here, right? So it's five problems here, five there, 10 in this one set, and it's due Monday by 8 a.m. So if I click on an assignment, this is what it looks like. So here is the problem. Notice down here, if there are multiple solutions, you can click plus, minus, you can click the keyboard if you want to have specific math symbols inserted. Also, there will be help videos on each topic that will walk you through it. So that's there as a resource for you. When you type in an answer, even if you don't type the, wrong, the right thing in, this is not going to be correct, click Submit Answer. It'll verify that that's what you want to enter, and then when you click it, it'll tell you it's incorrect. Notice here you have attempts remaining. Typically, I'll put three attempts per problem, and there's no penalty for getting it wrong. In other words, if I don't get this right after three tries, I just move on to the next question. You can go to here to see an example. If you want to move on, click the Give Up button. And in total, you're getting five questions right. So most Delta Math assignments, when you see this number here, that's the number you must get correct. It might take you 10 problems to get there, but once you've completed five problems correctly, you are finished. All right, thank you.